Avenge me, my brothers. <laughs> The Emperor has gifted us with a mission to redeem ourselves. The Blood Angels need no longer carry the burden of defeat. We have detected the sin of damnation near our home planet. Low frequency scans of the Space Hulk reveal the presence of gene steals. Brothers, vengeance shall be ours. Squad Red Zone, ready for deployment. Gaming Inspiration for you. Ooh, how's that mood lighting? You like that? Welcome, creators and gamers. Today, we're going to be looking at a game called Space Hulk. It's a new one. Let me tell you a brief intro of Space Hulk and where it comes from. Space Hulk comes from Warhammer. Warhammer, which comes from Games Workshop. And Games Workshop games like Warhammer, Warhammer 40k, 40K started as tabletop games so they still make them they still make new ones people are saying the company's coming to an end i don't know they say that they're kind of running their last final you know call of running as many products as possible before the company kind of goes bankrupt i don't know if that's true it's a big company they got a strong niche market so are they gonna fail i don't know but anyway Space Hulk comes from Warhammer 40k and Warhammer 40k is a world in the future of death, destruction, battle between different races of different worlds. And in Space Hulk you are the Space Marines which are basically the Imperial, the humans. They have their bodies attached to the armor, the armor so that it makes their armor uh, work with you and it makes you even more powerful sort of like a cyborg uh, What else? My favorite army when I used to play Warhammer 40k the tabletop version were the Tyranids and that's what we battle in Space Hulk. We battle the gene stealers gene stealers come from a planet Where every where all the creatures look like kind of like arachnids like insects insectoids if you've seen the movie Starship Troopers, well, the idea comes from more or less Warhammer, because that's an older idea, and even, uh, what's the game called, Star... the Blizzard game, what's it called? So popular. I don't know. Whatever it is. It's got the Zorgs. The Zorgs are kind of like this. So anyway, you got Gene Stealers. Uh, this game is based off of... Uh, where I was at. Continue last. This game is... Squad Lorenzo is under attack. Based off a old game. Actually, I had it on 3DO. If you got... If you had 3DO, shout out to you guys. 3DO was an awesome Panasonic gaming system. It was the best at its time. It really was. But it's not around anymore and it hasn't been. It's been bought out, I think. Anyway... This game was created on 3DO and the consoles back then, but now it's been redone. And also they've created a uh, board game of this game as well. And now, a long time ago, uh, some years ago, and now they just reinvented and recreated that game. You can buy it in the stores. It's pretty cool. I think it's the 2013 version, just like this game. So they just redid the digital game, this one, and the board game. The board game is pretty awesome. This game, I don't know what to think about it. I like it, um, but I sort of like the original. Because in the original, uh, you played as first person view kind of. 
the Emperor's finest. You played as first person, so you had the view of these guys, what they see. In this one, you have their camera, but it's pretty pointless because the whole game is, you know, shot from the top. So you're you're looking, you're at top down view. So what's the point of that little camera? There really is none. It's not cool enough for dramatic effect, and I don't know. It's not. It's not that necessary. Um, the old version of the game was cool because you you put the guys down and you kind of then you played first person. You, all you could see is what your Terminator. These guys are your Terminators. It's all your little Space Marine Terminator. Let's see, and it was pretty cool. You set up the strategy to where you guys would go. Position. Then you'd walk around, and sometimes you'd run into them in the tunnel. And you know that was a good feeling if you'd see your own kind. Anyway, so you see the map here. All I have to do is take my Terminators. This is a turn-based game too, which I don't think the original was. I'm not sure. Now the gene stealers, the creatures, will come from here, and here, and here. And what we have to do in this mission, this is like the third or fourth mission, saved it for you guys. I have a tough time with this one already. All I gotta do is take my terminators and move them here safely. I just need to move them there, and then I'm done. So let's see how I do. Uh, I'm done positioning them. Make sure they're ready to fire when these gene stealers come out. Uh, I can't. I can't do anything with him. All right. Let's see what happens. End turn. Sorry. Let me fix up my voice quality here for you. How's that? Is that better? I hope so. I hope so. All oh, right. Okay. So the gene stealers moved up. Uh, only from here. Okay. Cool. So this guy. What should we do? We're gonna do the flamethrower. Nice and easy. You like that? Nothing beats a flamethrower in these areas. In these parts of the world. Alright, he's ready. We'll keep him there. That should keep the gene stealers at bay. Uh, next, we're gonna put this guy... I don't know. Let's move him there. Let's see what happens. And this guy is going to follow up behind him. There we go. I think I need to put the flamethrower behind them all. I think that's the best strategy. Uh, let's see. This guy, we click on the eye button. That makes him overwatch. Scanning for any makes him ready to shoot. If anything moves in front of him, he's going to fire the hell out of it. Fire the poop out of it. Can't do much more. I'm afraid this guy's gonna get busted. I think he is gonna get busted. And no, we can't move him. I think he's a goner. He's a goner. Uh, that's not good. Ooh, see, my gun messed up. Now they're coming up. These guys will kick my ass at close combat. They will. As you can see, Gene Steeler's got power in them claws. You like this dramatic lighting? I think I'm gonna do it more often. Okay. Uh, let's see. We'll put this guy right there. Nice. He's shooting while he's moving. We'll keep him at Overwatch. This young man, he's gonna go over there. He's at Overwatch too. Good. Make sure that's on. Holding position. All right. This. Little man. Uh, well, let's turn him around. What if we move one step? Can we fire after one step? Let's take the risk. I don't know. Let's see. All right, we're here. We're facing them. Ooh, flamethrower on, baby. Flame on. Oh, my, did I hurt my guy? Did I hurt my... No, I didn't. Excellent, excellent. Now, let's move this guy up. Which is like the general, the leader. And this one, well, he's done. He's done. Uh, can we turn him around? Can we do anything with him? 
No, he's done. These guys are at Overwatch. I think I think we're doing all right. This might be my best try yet. And it's all because of you. All because of you, baby. Yeah, you. All right. They're coming out. Good. Anybody die? Uh, no. Okay. Excellent. 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 Unjam. The machine spirits have right. my breath. Sometimes you, your, your gun gets jammed, like a traffic jam. You get it, you know, jam. Kind of clogged, messed up, so you just got to fix that. Ooh, I like that. Just had to smash through there. He's such a big boy. Such a big boy. So these are humans Stella in brothers. big, powerful, futuristic armor. Pretty cool, huh? Uh, let's move this guy forward. Put him at Overwatch. On Overwatch. Oh, that was not good, maybe. That was not good. What I think we need to do is maybe fire here and then move. Let's do that. Let's fire. No, don't move. Can I shoot this here? Alright, let's move here. Hopefully we can fire. If we can't fire, he's a goner. Alright, can we fire? Excellent. We can fire. Okay, they're down. Now we quickly, we gotta move that way before these guys start coming out. Alright, here, overwatch, good. End turn. What happens? What's gonna happen? Oh, she was right there. I think we'll make it. We just need to save three of our guys. I think we can do it. Let's see. Alright. Uh, this boy. This guy's great at close combat. He's got a sword. I think he's got the sword. And he'll definitely... He's, uh... He's powerful. Okay. Um, he can't do anything anyway. <laughs> we should have just put him in there. Uh, that's alright. This one, Overwatch. Securing position. And this little man. Well, what can we do here? See, he's facing that way now. Actually, I could put these three guys in and I can win already. Why the? Oh, crap. I should have just done that. That's okay. That's okay. So let's take this guy and just make a run for it. Yeah. Or just blow these guys to smithereens. Let's blow them to smithereens. Shall we? And just like that. Oh. Okay, I think that'll block them. Wish I could block this whole room. Okay. Fire's up. He's done. He can't move. End the turn. Alright. I think we beat it. I think we beat it, guys. First try, while filming, beat this quest here, this mission. It's a mission, right? It's in the future. We don't call them quests. So, let's move them in there. And will that finish the mission for us? And keep the other guy alive? Let's see. That was... Uh, I guess we're gonna have to sacrifice this guy now. What about me? What about me? Um, let's make a run for it. He, he's dead. He's screwed. Guess we use the flamethrower guys as sacrifice to save the rest. So if you get hired as a space marine and they give you a flamethrower, You'll be remembered, <laughs> but not while you be alive. You're not gonna stay alive very long uh, with a flame. Well, no, that's not true. That's not true. Maybe it is. Let's see. Let's see in our next missions. Okay, good. So we're done. We beat that. Victory. Okay, what's next? Continue the campaign. Boarding torpedoes have breached the sin of damnation, and the sound of our bolters rings true through its corridors. 
It is imperative that we secure the beachhead before the gene stealers can mount a coordinated counterattack. Oh, I already did this. This was the first mission. Okay. Squad Lorenzo. Then I just did this one. All right, so we beat these three quests of the first set. Now we go to the second one. Sin of Damnation Suicide Mission. Sounds like the flamethrower's story, doesn't it? The sector well beyond control. All right, so I have to protect the battle brother who bears the heavy flame. Okay. If he falls. Oh, I guess it's a happy ending for the flamer here. Flamer. I mean, yeah, it's a happy ending for the flamer here. In this mission, we actually have to keep the flame guy alive. And we have to set the whole room to flames. So, I guess it's not bad. Maybe we just messed up on that mission. Huh? Don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. The thing I like about Space Hulk is that it's a 40k game, but it's it's such a niche of a game of a niche. I mean, instead of killing all these Tyranids, it's only Gene Stealers and it's only the Terminators fighting them. In 40k, this army you got Terminators, you got all sorts of units that you can use as, as well as tanks and stuff like that. And in Tyranids, ooh, you got a lot of deadly sons of... So, let's deploy. Uh, let's see, we'll put our flame guy... He'll be second, I don't know which one the flame guy is. I guess that's him. Okay, we'll put this guy in the front. Sergeant number two, flame guy number three, and the two bolter guys backing him up in the back. Giving it to them. Giving it to him in the back. Uh, I, 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 didn't, I didn't mean to say that. All right, here we go. Seeing that camera view again, is that useful? Did you even look at that when we were playing? Okay, so we need to go up here and flame this whole room. So let's move our first gentleman here. Moving out. It was good putting the sergeant in as second because he is a good leader, because he can kill in close combat. Most of these guys just die in close combat. He's actually Move. powerful in close combat, so I'm happy he's in the front. I like him there. All right. Move these two up. Move these are ahead. new recruits. It's their first day on the job. Let's see if they survive. <sighs> no, it isn't. What's the name? Dano and Brother Dano and Noctis. Dano and Noctis. All right. End turn. See if they're gonna come out. Okay, they're coming out here. And here. Ooh, I don't like how close that is to the final point. All right, those the gene stealers are pretty slow. Pretty slow. We'll move him right there. With all due haste. Hmm. Was that a good idea? I don't know. Okay. Well, I hope so. Follow right behind him. And you right behind him and you uh, stick around here for extra support let's see okay they're moving in enemy sighted Oop, they're moving in too okay oh and him he's the ugly duckling of the pack he's gonna blow, grow up to be a beautiful hive tyrant hmm Order confirmed. All right, let's move him forward one step. Has some fires at them. Nice. Let's move this guy here. Clear a path. Turn him around. Can we turn him out? Yes, we can. All right, looking good. Looking good. He's using the flame. All right, we can. Ooh, nice, nice. Let's do it. Right there. Got a little flames, got a little flames, yeah. Alright, moving the next boy up. Alright, yeah. Let's go stay watch here. Uh, we can kind of move him 
That's new over here. Are you turning around? Yeah. Let's see. Alright, turn around. Can't turn around. Can't turn around. Alright. Ooh, they killed my general. They killed my general. Ooh, what? No, 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 my flamer. That, that, that. All right, guys, that's that. Um, hope you enjoyed this. Give me some likes down there if you did. If this gets, uh, let's say, 30 views or at least four or five likes within a week or two, I'll make another video for you. Yeah? We can beat this game together, guys. I'll edit it for you, make it more exciting as much as I can. It is a turn-based game, I know how those can be for recording, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep playing it. It is more of a time killer game for me, rather than like really wanting to see the story and what happens next, because it's the, the mission is just going to repeat with different kind of maps. Did I just ruin it for you? Well, you know what, whatever you think about it, let me know in the comments then. Nobody comments. Nobody likes to talk to me. I like to talk to you. What am I doing right now? Hmm? You want to reply? Do it down there. Do it. Uh, do it down. Down there. Not down. Down there. Yeah, do it down there. Okay, you want to reply? You do it. Hope you guys enjoyed this. It gave you some sort of inspiration for expanding your imagination. Until next time. See ya and sleep well.